Angel Doc Stater has perfected the art of creating corn husk dolls. It's part of who I am. I grew up eating corn soup and cornbread and watching my mom make the dolls and drying the corn and my sister lies the corn. You know, um, it's it was for, uh, for me and, and my family, it was just a part of who we were. In fact, one piece entitled The Elder Brothers is part of a summer exhibition called War Games at the Canadian War Museum in Ottawa. Well, According to Andrew Birch, the exhibit are, uh, looks at the historical kind of intersection of war played in games. He said the size, scale and detail of the Cornhusk set makes it a key piece of art for the exhibition. So this for us was a really interesting artifact, a really uh, compelling artwork that also linked into this message to the way that games spread and are adapted and adopted throughout different cultures over time. And it also had a, a personal history for uh, the artist, Angel Doxtator, who played chess with her family. And so this was something that was something that, that uh, they did for fun. And she integrated her artwork into something that was a, uh, a, a source of enjoyment for her. Back home in Six Nations, Angel Dockstater says the piece took over a year to complete. They she says she's pleased to see her work is on display. Really. She says in a way it pays homage to her grandfather. My grandfather was a World War II vet. And they weren't treated great at all. You know, um, I'm sure you know the history of that. And my grandfather was on the beach in Normandy. You know, he, he was he was a he was a vet. And I, I just growing up seeing how they were treated, you know, our, our First Nations vets, you know, like it's unreal. And so when he wanted to use that in the war museum, I'm like, Yes, do that. Any day of the week you'll find her and her partner John at work in their craft shop. I'm just putting the legs on this guy. Or girl, whatever she Making these dolls is a full-time business. During the pandemic, you know, it was very good to us because we work from home and a lot of people were purchasing from, from home-based businesses, right, during the pand pandemic. Um, but the recognition kind of started with the chess set. Uh, the orders are, are good. They're, you know, I'm not going to be driving, a, you know, a Bentley in five months from it, but... You know, it pays the bills, right? It pays everything. More of Doc Stater's work can be found online. The War Games exhibition will be on display until the end of December. And at Francis, APTN National News.